No, it's just good to have everybody out here for Ignite Worship again. So thanks for joining us. Woo. We're going to be bringing you the season of Advent tonight. So we're going to start with a really special song called Even So Come. And we can put that up there. Yeah, if you know it, you can sing along with us. Um, mm hmm Savior, the Messiah, who is Christ the Lord. Blessed is our God, and blessed are God's gifts, that grace, with us, grace us with forgiveness and every good gift. Lord, you have come to dwell within us. Build your temple within our hearts. Amen. I invite our leader for our call to worship to come join us. 
right up there. <coughs> okay, that works. Uh, a voice cries out into the wilderness, prepare the way of the Lord. Make God's path straight. Every valley will be filled and every mountain will be leveled. The crooked will be made straight. The rough and rocky ways will be smoothed. All will see the salvation of God. See the light from on high. The dawn is breaking. The Lord is coming. The Lord is coming. We're going to start the song for you and have you come and join us along the way as we prepare for our Lord. Prepare ye the way, prepare ye the way of the Lord. The first candle, candle of hope, means his promise and hope. We can have hope because God is faithful and will keep his promises. He made us. Our hopes come from God. Romans, Romans chapter 15, verses 12 through 13. second candle, candle of preparation, means his light and preparation. Prepar preparation means to get ready. Help us to be ready to welcome you, O God. 
Luke chapter 3, verses 4 through 6. Our third candle. The third candle, candle of joy, means the angels sang a message of joy. Luke chapters 2, 7 through 15. The fourth candle, candle of love, symbolizes Christ, Christ's love. God sent his only son to earth to save us because he loves us. John chapters 3, 16 through 17. From Luke, the third chapter. In the fifteenth year of the reign of Emperor Tiberius, when Pontius Pilate was governor of Judea, and Herod was ruler of Galilee, and his brother Philip ruler of the region of Ituria, and Triconin, Triconitus, and Lysanias, ruler of Abilene. During the high priesthood of Annas and Caiaphas, the word of God came to John, son of Zechariah, in the wilderness. He went into all the region around the Jordan, proclaiming a baptism of repentance for the forgiveness of sins. As it is written in the book of the words of the prophet Isaiah, the voice of one crying out in the wilderness, prepare the way of the Lord, make his path straight. Every valley shall be filled and every mountain and hill shall be made low, and the crooked shall be made straight, and the rough ways made smooth. And all flesh shall see the salvation of God. As I mentioned, this is a journey through the season. The season of Advent is, you know what Advent means? I have one, Pastor Sarah. Yes. I'm waiting for a grandson. Yeah.
these are all worldly things as well, right? And we can have hope in them, but that doesn't necessarily mean that we they will actually happen. Doesn't mean my turkey will not be burned to a crisp on Thanksgiving. Doesn't mean that we're gonna get a squish model for Christmas. We can hope. But these are worldly things, but there's no promise that they will actually happen or we will receive them. But when we light the candle of hope, we are placing our hope in something bigger than ourselves and bigger than this world. We're placing our hope in God, in God's promises to be there for us in every season of our lives, including this one. Because God always fulfills God. play her musical instruments.
So we use the candles in the church as a symbol of the light, the light that is Christ. And Christ invites us to go be light for others and let our light shine so all people can see our good works. So I'm going to invite you to stand with us now, either on your cell phone or just with the flick of your finger as light. Can you just do this with me as we sing this next song?
as we wait for Christ's arrival. Let us pray for our world and for one another. Come to us, O oh Emmanuel. Come to us, O oh Emmanuel. God of hope, you come into our lives at the times when we need you the most. When shadows surround us and our hearts are hurting, you are the light that shows us the path to hope. We ask you to be a hope for us this week as we face moments of challenge and stress, of heartache and worry. God, we pray for all those worried about schoolwork and tests and projects, about upcoming presentations, tournaments and matches. Be our strength and our advocate and help us to remember that we do not need to be perfect to be loved by you. God, we ask for your hope to shine in the lives of our loved ones, for friends and family who are sick or hurting, for safe travels for our loved ones as the holidays come up, and for all those who need your comforting presence in their lives. Our radiant God of hope, we pray to you. Come to us, O Emmanuel. Come to us. We wait and long for you, Lord, and as we wait, we prepare our hearts and our spirits for the arrival of your Son into this world. As we move through the season of Advent and we expectantly wait for the joy of Christmas, help us to live lives of goodness and faithfulness, of gentleness and love. Help us to prepare ourselves for the day that your son returns to us. And as we prepare, help us to slow down, to remember the things that are most important. Special time with family and friends, good rest, and thankfulness for all the ways you show up in our lives. Lord, we pray to you. Come to us, O Emmanuel, come to us, O Emmanuel. God of joy, your spirit overwhelms us and brings wonder into our lives. The joy of the first snow, the twinkling lights that warm our hearts at night, the delight of seeing loved ones that we have not seen in a long time. Help us to remember to always look for the joy in life and to spread joy to others in every word that we share and move that we make. May your joy spread to all your people this season and may it be a lasting joy that sustains us through every valley and over every mountain. God of joy, we pray to you. Come to us, O Emmanuel, come to us, O Emmanuel. God of love, you sent your Son, Jesus, into this world so that your love for us would shine brighter than any doubt, hurt, or hardship that we could ever come across. You sent your love to us in the form of a baby, small and fragile, knowing that he would grow into something that would change our world forever. Continue to shower us with your love all throughout this season, Lord, and help us to share that love with everyone we meet. God of love, we pray to you. Come to us, O God of our longing, you know our deepest needs. By your spirit, gather our prayers and join them with the prayers of all your children. In Jesus' name we pray. 
Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And also with you. Let us share a sign of peace with one another and then gather around the altar for communion. God, you've gathered us here in this place to wait, to express longing and hope for your son, who on the night in which he was betrayed took bread, his body, but that we may all take and eat and know his touch and his presence here and in all things. On that same night, he also took his blood, in which we taste his love and forgiveness poured out for us. At this table, we celebrate the life that Jesus has shared among his community through the centuries and shares again with us now. With all who share this heavenly food, Lord, the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. We join our hands together and pray the prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thy name is the kingdom. 
scattered and broken, bent in our
I think you were the angels. Yes. <laughs> Sounded like the angel chorus. <laughs> with this one. Do this with me. Stay with me in the rhythm. It's really important. One, two, three, and...